All right, Shalom Yashirala, back again with another Lord with the edifying video. Through the spirit and the power of Yahweh, Bahashem Shai. Before I begin this lesson, I would to give all honor and glory and praises unto the Heavenly Father and to His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Racha Kodash. And next up, double honors to our apostles and our elders of Great Millstone. Who still got her to the hours of bowers and feed us with through 100% truth according to the Bible and her well and peace, blessings, and safety and mercy and to the Akims out there who was pushing the truth in the four corners of the earth with boldness, righteousness, and in sincerity to the best of their abilities in the names of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. And back at it with another lesson to the spirit of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, on um, another quick lesson to the spirit. And it's going to be on Isaiah 8 and 20. This is the book of Isaiah chapter 8 verse 20. To the law and to the testimony. If they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them. Right. And, that, and that's, that's, that's for anybody who, uh, for, uh, who, who, who doesn't go according to the scriptures, man. You know? And the light represents the knowledge of wisdom and the understanding which Yahabai Shemar Shah has to give to you, man. So to the law and to the testimony, if a person doesn't speak according to this word, which is mainly to the Israelites, because the word was only given to the Israelites to speak in the first place, you know. So to the law and to the testimony, if they don't speak according to this word, what is this word? The word, this, the word is the uh, the King James 1611 Holy Bible, man. That's the word of the Lord, man. You know. Matter of fact, let me get a precept. The Spirit, somebody uh, do a precept. Uh, the Spirit of Summer do a precept, so do a precept. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 147, verse 19. He showed his word unto Jacob, and his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. Right. The scripture says that the Lord Yahabai Shema Shah showed his word unto Jacob. Jacob represents the so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians, and confusion of faces who look like the other nations but are Israelites, man. He said he showed his word, which is this Bible. The King James Holy 1611 Bible, man, unto Jacob, man, you know? And right now, it's all about the elect of the nation of Israel. Yahweh Shem Yahashah show off his word unto the elect right about now. The wisdom of knowledge and understanding of the scriptures, he showed unto the, to the elect, man, you know? Which Lord willing, we're hoping to be, you know? Um, His statues and his judgments unto Israel, right? And it's in his statutes and his judgments unto Israel, man. The law, statutes, and commandments of the scriptures was given unto Israel, man. And transgression, the law, statutes, and commandments of the Bible is uh is sin, you know, you know. But it was only given to the Israelites. So we're gonna go back to the book of Isaiah, the eighth chapter, and read it again. To get more understanding. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter eight, verse twenty, to the law and to the testimony. If they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them, right? Because now they're leading unto their own understanding, man, which the scriptures tells you not to do. The scripture says in Proverbs 3 and 5, to trust in the Lord with all thy heart and lean not unto the way of their own understanding, man. Because once you lead into your own understanding, there is where sin comes in, man. And then what sin promotes? Death, you know? So if you do not speak according to the Holy Scriptures, man, breaking down the scriptures the right way, correctly and directly, or not even bringing out the scriptures at all, you know? Is because there is no no light in them, man. And the light represents the wisdom and knowledge and understanding of the scriptures, you know. And why you don't have and why you don't have no light in you? Because your high by Shemiel Shah didn't give you the, the light, the knowledge, the wisdom and understanding to understand the scriptures, you know. So two when two thirds of our people come out there on the highways and heads, so even on the comment boards making stupid remarks concerning the scriptures, man, like like uh God loves everybody. Uh, 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 that all the tribes are black, you know what I'm saying? Which we're not black to begin with, black as a color, you know what I'm saying? You know, open the crayon box, you know what I'm saying? You know, it, 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 it come up with all types of stupidness, man. All types of foolishness, man. You know, because they're not speaking according to this word, man. You know, and I, they're not obeying your high by Shimei Shai, you know. So that's why they don't have any light in them. And Yahabai Shemiah and Shah didn't want them to get the wisdom and knowledge and understanding of the scriptures either because they wasn't chosen by them. 
You have to be chosen to do this thing, man. And Yahabashimah has to give you the wisdom and knowledge to understand the scriptures because you want to know why? Because it's his to begin with. Then that Lord Yahweh Shah said that the doctrine that he come in is not his, roughly paraphrasing, but the Father. So this is Lord Yahweh's doctrine, man. And then he passed it down to Lord Yahweh Shah. That's why we say Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shah. You know what I'm saying? You know, we definitely got to glorify the Son because he's the mediator between us and the Heavenly Father, man. And the Heavenly Father was given the light, you know, the wisdom and knowledge and understanding. Then he gave it to his Son. Then now the Son gave it to, to, to you know what I'm saying? The, the Israelites. The, the hopeful elect, you know? Because that's who the Lord is dealing with right about now. But in the kingdom, everybody's going to have the wisdom and knowledge and understanding the laws, you know? But that's in the kingdom, though. Two-thirds of our people have to be destroyed, you know? So with that, hey, with well, Lord willing, that was edifying for y'all considered as watching to the Spirit. I want to give all honor and glory and praises and thanks to the Heavenly Father and to His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, and next up, the Boanish to our apostles and our elders of Great Millstone, who still got into the hallways of Bowies and feed us with the 100% truth according to the Bible and her rule well. And peace, blessings, and safety and mercy to the Yachims out there who was pushing the truth in the four corners of the earth with boldness, righteousness, and in sincerity to the best of their abilities in the names of Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. We're the people here for a bear. With that, shalom, kwamiyashi Allah.